Right, so now we're going to look at driving the 29er. When you're looking to drive the 29er, you want to try to do it in as flat water as possible, or if it's, there's a big swell, you want to be surfing down a wave. This is just to keep the speed through the manoeuvre. So when you're driving, you want to have as much speed as possible. This will make life so much easier with the apparent wind, will just mean the sails float over. If you don't have a lot of speed, the boom can slam across, and then that will probably end up in a capsize. So when you're driving, just for the manoeuvre, the helm can swap their hands by bringing the, their main sheet hand over the tiller. And when you're going through the manoeuvre, it's important that the helm brings the boom across the boat. They can do this by grabbing the main sheet block or just the boom, bringing it over so it can't slam across. When you're going through the manoeuvre, you want to make sure the boat is dead flat or a bit to windward. This is again just to keep the speed up. And you really don't want leeward heel because if you dip a wing in, it will just slow the boat down. Your main can slam across and it will probably end up in a capsize. Right, so when you're going through the manoeuvre, you want to make sure you're killing the kite. You do this by pulling the old sheet right to the block. It's just going to kill all the power out of the kite. And then you can grab the new sheet, pull it across and complete the jive. So when you're in the manoeuvre, you want to make sure that you want to try and make the manoeuvre last six seconds. So you want to again, like attack, not be pausing in the middle of the boat. But you can take your time with a jive because you've got more speed. Once you've completed the jive, cruise on the wire, helms on the side. You want to get going as quick as possible, get, get the pace back on. Just to summarise key points in the manoeuvre, again it's really important that both the helm and crew know what's going on and you want to be approaching the jive with as much speed as you can uh, to help the boom come across and help the manoeuvre carry on. Uh, it's really important that the helm swaps their hands early, so bringing their main sheet hand above their tiller hand, or everything will just get tangled. Helm really has to pull the boom across to stop the slamming. And again, you want to keep it as flat as possible or slightly to windward through the manoeuvre. And when you're on the exit, you just want to get accelerating as quick as possible. Uh, and when it's breeze on, you want to make sure you're killing the kite by pulling the old sheet right to the block, just to take all the power out of the kite, and then you can drive the boat and sort it out later.